the partnership began based on the vision of the president of Northeast Ohio Medical University, Jay Gershon, and the president of CSU, Ron Berkman. They each wanted to do something about health disparities in urban communities. I've never been associated with a program with such focus and mission. As a matter of fact, I had the privilege of working with Congressman Lewis Stokes, who co-chaired this community advisory board for the five years before he died. But he said that, that of all the things he has done in healthcare, he loved this because it, 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 it was getting closer to providing access in the communities of need. We have over 160 students in the program. We're over 30% diverse. 90% of them are remaining committed to primary care. 80% of them want to stay here in Cleveland. Our students start training in the city the minute they get here. Sometimes we, even before we hang a stethoscope around their neck or a clinic coat. I grew up in an urban community without health care. Neither of my parents have a college education. I kind of grew up around medicine. My mom's a physician. I want to go into pediatrics and work with young kids and help them out. To be here is just an amazing experience to work with these people and to learn from them and to see what I could potentially do to help others. So when this program and this opportunity was brought to me, it was really exciting and it made me think this is where I need to be. I want to be back in my community giving back to those in need. And I think through healthcare, we're not just helping them with the health problems, we're helping them with their family, with their life. You're helping the whole family together as a unit and I think that's amazing. There's a lot of emphasis on cultural competency and really understanding and appreciating the diversity of individuals. We actually have patients from the community that come in and that actually teach us, which I think is just such a beautiful thing. So there's always that connection to the community. It's not like you're in a silo for four years. Community is with us throughout our entire academic journey while at Neomed. This building has one of the most innovative state-of-the-art systems here in Northeast Ohio. I've never seen this kind of technology. It's our foundation for training teams of individuals that can go out in the community and practice care the way we know it's gonna be practiced from now on. The nurses and the physicians, pharmacists and speech and hearing and PTOT, it's a communication that fosters collaboration. Being able to do our physical diagnosis lab here, um, being able to do our seminar courses here in the small rooms where we can watch ourselves um, doing our patient interviews from Neomed, it's a great learning experience. And we have physicians in there talking to us and we're able to give each other feedback. We really take a stance on teaching our students the value of the relationships with patients, the value of the empathic communication behind all interactions. You learn how to show empathy, you learn how to really hear what someone's saying, take it in and show them that you care about them. And I think that's a huge part of healthcare that we don't work on enough. These are our future leaders. These are the doctors that are going to change the world because they can build relationships. The secret in being a great physician is to love your patient. And that's what we emphasize.